Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Who were John Tyler's wives? John Tyler, the 10th President of the United States, had two wives during his lifetime. His first wife was Letitia Christian Tyler, whom he married on March 29, 1813, his 23rd birthday. Letitia Christian was born on November 12, 1790, at the Cedar Grove Plantation in New Kent County, Virginia. She was raised as a devout Episcopalian and learned the skills necessary to manage a plantation, rear a family, and preside over a home. The couple had eight children together, with seven surviving infancy. Letitia became the First Lady of the United States when her husband assumed the presidency in 1841, following the death of President William Henry Harrison. However, due to a stroke in 1839 that left her permanently disabled, she was unable to perform the duties of First Lady and delegated them to her daughter-in-law, Priscilla Cooper Tyler. Letitia passed away on September 10, 1842, while still in her role as First Lady, becoming the first person to die in the White House. After Letitia's death, John Tyler married Julia Gardner, who was significantly younger than him. Julia was born on May 4, 1820, and met the president in 1842 during the winter social season in Washington. Their relationship blossomed after a tragic incident on February 28, 1844, when Julia's father, David Gardner, was killed in the explosion of the USS Princeton's gun, the Peacemaker. This event brought Julia and the president closer together, leading to their marriage on June 26, 1844. Julia Gardner, Tyler, became the second wife of President John Tyler and served as the First Lady of the United States for the final eight months of his presidency. She was known for her vivacity and her efforts to revitalize the role of the First Lady, including redecorating the White House and establishing social traditions that mimicked European monarchies. The couple had seven children together and moved to the Sherwood Forest Plantation in Virginia after leaving the White House. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.